lack of transparency is a huge political advantage. And John Kerry said, no, 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 we're going to tax your health insurance. We're going to tax those evil insurance companies. We're going to impose a tax that if they sell health insurance, it's too expensive. We're going to tax them. And conveniently, the tax rate will happen to be the marginal tax rate under the income tax code. So basically, it's the same thing. We just tax the insurance companies. They pass it on higher prices. That offsets the tax break we get. It ends up being the same thing. It's a very clever, you know, basically exploitation of the, of the, of the lack of economic understanding of the American voter. We will keep this promise to the American people. If you like your doctor, you will be able to keep your doctor, period. This American voter is too stupid to understand. Lack of transparency is a huge political advantage. And basically, you know, call it the stupidity of the American voter or whatever. But basically, that was really, really critical to getting the thing to pass. The point is that you have equal impact on serious speeches because it's about style, use of language, etc. Uh, I really like, I was very, the, the joke speech is the most fun part of this, but the things I'm the most proud of were the more serious speeches, I think. Healthcare, um, uh, economic speeches, and I think I... Lovett wrote the line about... Um, if you like your insurance, you can keep it. How dare you? It's true. <laughs> <laughs> Huge impact. And you know what? It's still true. No. Yeah. But, uh, uh... When I went through the process of becoming press secretary, one of the things, one of the first things they told me was, you're not even to acknowledge the drone program. Yeah. You're not even to discuss that it exists. Wow. And so I would get a question like that, and literally, I, I couldn't tell you what Major asked, because once I figured out it was about the drone right. program, <laughs> I realized I'm not supposed to talk about wow. it. And, but here's what's inherently crazy about that proposition. You're being asked a question based on reporting of a program that exists. <laughs> right. Yeah. So you're the official government spokesperson exactly. acting as if the entire program, pay no attention to the man oh. behind the curtain. Right. Yeah. It's, it, I think in many ways, and I think what the president has seen, and I have not talked to him about this, so I want to be careful. Right. This yeah, is yeah. my opinion. Yeah, yeah. But I, I think what the president has seen is, our denial of the existence of the program, when it's obviously happening, uh, undermines uh, people's confidence overall in the decisions that their government makes. Welcome to the State Department. I think we have some interns in the back. Welcome. Uh, good to see you in this uh, exercise in transparency and democracy. <laughs> <laughs> is that what it is? <laughs> Sorry, I thought it was. I didn't mean to break I thought it was an exercise, of, <laughs> an exercise in spin and obfuscation. All right, can you tell us in my last brief? This America is too stupid. Uh, good to see you in this uh, exercise in transparency and democracy. 